And Ashley, we have finally made it to Harbor Fest. It's the 48th year of the event. I'm so excited about it. It's always a great time for our area. We've got games, we've got events, concerts, shows. People pour in all weekend long to get in on the fun. And that's where we find our Casey Baylor this morning. Casey, a lot to look forward to this weekend. Ashley, you missed one of the main points of Harbor Fest, the ships. I mean, take a look behind me. They look so pretty. And then also, like, shout out to the water right there. I saw that before this hit. Anyway, I want you to take a look at these ships because one of them I actually thought was really cool. I did a little bit of research. Yeah, and by research, I just mean, you know, a quick Google search. But this is AJ Mirwald, one of the ships that will be heading out along the Elizabeth later. Now, she's based out of New Jersey and she's used as a traveling classroom. And of course, a nice little vehicle to take a, a, a nice stroll along the water and catch some beautiful views. So this is just, again, one of the nice, fun parts of Harbor Fest. But also, Harbor Fest has a lot of new activities as well. We're talking about the X Pogo Extreme Show. There's comedy, there's juggling. I got to look at my notes here because there's also a skate stunt show. Because there are so many events and activities taking place over the next couple of days, it also takes a lot of planning and preparing. And also, we can't forget about some of the staples here, too. We're talking about the fireworks display as well as the parade of, sta uh, parade of sale. You know, we've got a, a new tradition that we've started, which is our drone show on Friday evening. Um, you know, several, a few hundred drones going up and uh, a chore choreographed display over the river, really a sight to see. Um, our fireworks is a, a long-standing tradition, one of the largest, best fireworks displays on the entire east coast of the country. Um, that's Saturday evening. Um, you know, and then all of the amazing music, the food, the entertainment, the family activities. Now the Parade of Sail is a festival staple. It kicks off today at noon. That's where you'll get to see so many of these other ships, again, parading along the Elizabeth River. It's so much fun to see and it's beautiful. Like actually, I can't wait to see it. That's what I have now. I'll be back in the next half hour for uh, some more fun here in Norfolk. <laughs> Ashley, Eugene. Well, Casey, you know, we're so excited for Harbor Fest, but you mentioned the ships behind you and the ones that, of course, will be coming in at noon today. We're so excited for Parade of Sail. So make sure you watch at noon for our special on the Parade of Sail. Yeah, we're going to have a lot of fun, hopefully as much fun as Casey is, is having right half. now. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, you know what? Another thing that would be really great today, you can come out and see us because we're going to be out there mm -hmm. for Harbor Fest. Fest, 13 News Now crew. All of us have different times. I know I'm 3.30 to 6. and I'll yeah. be around there all, all day. <laughs> Not all day. <laughs> Come see me early in the afternoon. Yeah, it's going to be a good time. And seriously, watch the noon show. If you've never watched Parade of Sail at noon, they're out on the water. It's fun. The ships are coming by. It's epic. You yeah. 